My name is Mark Humphreys with Lincoln Electric Cutting Systems and today we're going to teach you how to rip cut your material. This is going to be very handy when you're looking to preserve blocks of material from a larger sheet of metal that you've already cut because we all know how awkward it can be to load a large sheet of metal onto the table that has flimsy sections of scrap metal. We're going to start with this sheet of metal and we're going to guide the torch to the very edge of the material where we're going to start the rip cut. You must be very accurate with setting this program zero. From here, you can go about it two ways. One, you can toggle the torch in the tool library window and manually fire and traverse the torch using the toggle keys below. Keep in mind that you will have to manually adjust the speed at which you are cutting, but this is the fastest way to do a rip cut. The other option is to measure the length of your plate and program that distance under the point tab of your traverse methods. Make sure to program the distance to run along whichever axis you'll be cutting. So in our specific situation, we're going to be cutting 18 and a half inches along the X positive direction. And this is 11 gauge mild steel, so we're going to be programming our feed rate at about 150 inches per minute. You'll program this feed rate as the last input before you turn your plasma cutter on. Make sure you have zero and feed selected. Now you're ready to toggle on the torch and watch it cut. I hope you learned something in this video, and if you did, let us know about it in the comments section below. Or you can find our thread on fabricationforum.com under the CNC cutting discussion topic. There, you'll not only be able to interact with all of our technicians here on staff, but you'll also be able to interact with porch mate owners from around the world. Thanks for watching.